If you're looking for something fun to do tonight or this weekend, Austin Shakespeare has performances of As You Like It. Tori Liner sat down with a few of the actors to learn what makes this show so entertaining. Austin Shakespeare Theater brought together one of Shakespeare's most romantic of comedies with music from some of Austin's talented songwriters in their play, As You Like It. And to talk more about this play, we have with us today Emily Christine Smith, who plays the lead character, Rosalind, and of course, Matthew Graham Wagner, who plays Orlando. In a little while, we're going to hear from Emily with a preview of a, of a song from the play. But first, good morning, guys. Glad morning. to have you. Good morning. Now, tell us about this play. What is it about? So, As You Like It is one of Shakespeare's comedies, and it is the story of uh, myself who has been banished from my home, and I have to go live in the woods, and I disguise myself as a man, and while I'm there, I have this sort of playful relationship with Orlando as we kind of fall in love, and then there are also, um, you know, other stories of other characters falling in love, and the Duke trying to get his lands back and all of that kind of stuff. So it's uh, a really fun just play of people kind of finding themselves in the woods, if you will. Yeah, and it's so amazing because a lot of it's based off Shakespeare, but there's a lot of Austin ties in this place, mm -hmm. they're not? Yeah, so we, uh, As You Like It has five places where Shakespeare actually put in songs. So um, our director decided that we were going to take those out and actually put in Austin singer-songwriter songs. And so all of the songs from the show are from artists here. And then that kind of informed the costume design and the set design and everything is kind of a love story to Austin and the live music scene and the hill country. I love that all this local Austin songwriters, you know, Austin's so big for music. So I love to see that. Now, how much hard work did you guys in practice put into this play and getting ready for it? Yeah, so uh, I believe we started rehearsals in the second week of October, October, right? Yeah. yeah, so we've been working on this for seven weeks until mm -hmm. up until the first day of performances, and then we've been doing three weeks of, this is our third week of performances, so mm -hmm. yeah, two and a half months of uh, working at it, so. That is a long time. How do you guys stay motivated, kind of doing the same thing over and over and staying, um, you know, each show being like it's the last show? Yeah, I always go into every show remembering that a lot of people have never seen Shakespeare before. So I always try to remind myself that I could potentially be the first person they've ever seen perform Shakespeare, and that is a huge thing to sort of take on as a person. So I always try to make sure that I do Shakespeare proud. I don't know about you. Yeah, uh, for me, I just, um, you know, I, I, I go into every performance and just kind of think about less, less about what the audience is thinking and more you know, as Orlando, you know, mm -hmm. going through this experience again every night is kind of a new, always going to be a new one for me, and always kind of, um, what what do you, what do I need as Orlando? What do I need to do in this moment? And just kind of focusing on my scene partner or mm -hmm. my, my, you know, my fellow castmates and really getting what I want, and then that way, it just it's always new and it's always kind of fresh. So yeah, and uh, very quickly, just uh, for people who don't know what Austin Shakespeare is, can you give us a quick uh, briefing of what that is? Yeah, Austin Shakespeare is a theater company in Austin that is housed out of the Long Center, and they perform mostly Shakespeare, but also kind of. Um, like high, uh, they also do a lot of like Tom Stoppard, they're doing Hedda Gabler next, so a lot of more classical theater or um, sort of loftier, elevated language, if you will. Yeah, I love it. And then before we wrap up and hear uh, some music from you, uh, when is this playing going through? So we have performances tonight through Sunday. Um, our night shows are Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday at 7.30, and then our Sunday show is at 3 p.m. All right, well, I'm very excited. I hope everyone goes out to hear it. But first, let's get a little sneak preview from a song with Emily. She knows the high. 